So I was watching Charleston, watching Charleston White video. And I just remember you saying that shit about uh, Derek Chauvin and saying how you hope he gets off. You hope he uh, gets free. And I just can't understand for the life of me why you don't keep that same energy on Vlad. You get on Vlad and it's like you showing off or something. Like you just got totally different energy, which is good energy, but just be you, man. Stay being you. Stay the same person, man. Don't get on the white platform and just change up on us. I already don't like the fact that you said you ain't ain't no black person ever did no it like I don't know what Charleston White on, but he on some other shit. But uh, when Vlad asked him about Derek Chauvin, he was totally different. It was totally different. But when you was on Say Cheese, you was, oh, I hope he gets free. And I hope he, you know, I hope he uh, gets let out. And I hope he gets found not guilty. And and I just can't understand for the life of me why Charleston White and Hassan Campbell got a problem with George Floyd. Like, y'all call them dope fiends and crackheads and... Hassan Campbell mocks him and, you know, act like he's choking and uh, saying he deserved what he did. He was too big to be getting held down. Like, it's just crazy to me. All because he was a, they saying because he was on drugs. So it's like because the person's on drugs, he deserved to die. If that's the case, that means weed users, pill users, everybody needs to die. Liquor. So a lot of people, liquor kill a lot of people, innocent people. What you talk about like lean, lean, perks, heroin, all is the same thing. Whether you want to admit it or not, it's all the same thing. It's a fucking opiate. It's opiates. But back to the topic, I just can't understand why y'all got a problem. Like, what did George Floyd do besides use a fake $20 bill? That still don't mean the man deserved to die. He ain't deserved to die, did he? And I'm already kind of a little irritated because I just made a video and the shit just cut off and I got to redo it. And I don't forget half of the shit I said because like I told y'all, I get up here and I just go. But, yeah, I remember Charleston White on Say Cheese. He said he hoped Derek Chauvin get free. He hoped that he get found not guilty. But then when you get on Vlad, it's... a little different you look a little more a lot more humble you a lot more humble it's like the white man humbled your ass i just don't like i just like people who stay the same keep the same energy unless you know that you're wrong and admit that you're wrong but other than that keep the same energy man don't 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 switch it up. Don't change when you get on other people platforms and act like this when you get like you act like a nigga when you want the black shit, but when you want the white boy, you wanna you know sit all proper and you know try to talk all proper and you know you're not yelling in as much and hey instructor like all type shit ass nigga. I just don't understand it, man. I don't understand what is the problem why Charleston White and Hassan Campbell does not like George Floyd. When the man lost his life for nothing. Over nothing. Because he used a fake 20. Or what? Because he was a doe. If you ask Hassan Campbell, it's because he was a dope fiend. No, that's Charleston White. Hassan Campbell, he say he's a crackhead, a crackhead. Charleston White calls him a dope fiend. So everybody out there, if you know somebody on drugs, watch out, because Hassan Campbell and uh, Charleston White, they want them to die. They don't think they should be living. They're despicable to them. Because they made a bad choice in life and got hooked on a drug, which is so easy to do, especially if you start from a young age. Uh, 
they feel you should be wiped off the fucking earth. And it's came out of their mouth. Like, I ain't just making this shit up. Charleston White called DMX a dope fiend. Said, like, like fuck it, he need to be dead. He, he, he was a dope fiend. What? That dope, that DMX, that dope fiend changed a lot of people lives helped a lot of people get through a lot of hard times helped a lot of people get through pain helped a lot of people get through struggle he might have turned somebody around from going to kill somebody but what have you done mr white that's all you should be worried about is what have you done I just don't understand this talking down on people who died and and uh I just don't get it. Like they're dead. They can't fight back. They can't fight back. But y'all want to talk about dead people all the time. But the main reason for the video was because of the Derek Chauvin. When you was on Say Cheese, you said you hope Derek Chauvin get free. You hope he gets found not guilty. And if I recall correctly, you said because you want to see what we going to do. We as in black people. But when Vlad asked you about it, it's... I just don't think nothing's gonna change. I mean, you know, we've we've had more police killing since then, and you know, I just like where's that? Like, I just don't. Three sixty, man. You just all over the place. You don't know who you want to be. You and Hassan Campbell, y'all don't know who y'all want to be. Y'all want to be motivational speakers. Y'all want to be thugs. Y'all want to be rappers. Y'all want to be actors. Like y'all just don't know what y'all want to be. And in the in the in the process, y'all is contradicting yourself. Again, I watch both of them. I'm gonna continue to watch. I like their content, some of it, but some shit I just don't agree with. And I'm gonna I'm gonna say it. If I agree with it, I'm gonna say it. And like I say, at the end of the day, everybody's human. At the end of the day, anybody can lose their life. I don't care who you are. Doesn't matter. If a bullet hits your head, you out of here. So, we not doing no, oh, I got more money than you. Oh, you're just a, a, a peon. You're just a little kid. You're just a, it, I'm a gangster. I've been in jail 50 times. You never walk the cell. Like, I don't, I don't, we don't do that no more. Because it don't matter who you is, you can lose your life. You can lose your life. It ain't about who shoot first. It's about who get hit first. For watch your circle before they hurt you. Got more shit to say, man, about your boy Hassan, man. But we ain't gonna get into that. This was about Charleston White. He just came in the picture because, you know, he be running his mouth about George Floyd, too. But you already know the fucking vibes, man. If you ain't did it yet, make sure you subscribe. I'm trying to get to 500,000. You hear me? 500K. We want 500K subscribers. But as always, man, I don't care if I get 500. I don't care if I get five. Shout out to everybody who follow the boy, who subscribe to the kid, man, who watch the shit, who listen to the shit, man. It's a lot of good stories, a lot of good, uh, it's a lot of good uh, knowledge in a lot of my videos, man. I got a lot of them. So if you ain't watched a few, go check them out, man. You already know the fucking vibes, man. Follow me on Instagram, Facebook, YouTube, Snapchat, all that good shit. Trey Luciano on Luke. Uh, Trey Luciano on Instagram, Trey Luciano on Facebook, Trey Luciano on Snapchat, 
Hey, Trey on YouTube. You already know what it is, man. We out of this bitch game.